Well, hello, everybody, and it's great to be back with you once again. I'm Mara Hannigan, your Suffolk County Criminal Court Clerk at the Superior Court for Criminal Business. And it's just uh, been beautiful weather out there. I'm sure you've all been enjoying it. And hard to believe that uh, summer is winding down. And actually, this weekend is going to be the first day of fall. So hopefully, we'll get a nice Indian summer. And we actually have a real treat for you today. And you know, as part of my show, usually we have two half-hour segments. But every once in a while, we have a program that really requires more time. And for those of you who are jazz fanatics and, and like jazz music, and even for those who you don't know a lot about jazz, you are in for a real treat today. Uh, we have a very distinguished gentleman, uh, Rick Delarada, who uh, is with Jazz for Peace, a renowned musician. And we are so fortunate to have him. But before I officially introduce him to you, I'd like to read you a little bit about him and Jazz for Peace, which we talked about during the summer months, but we're just so fortunate to have him today, here with you today. And also, he's going to be playing uh, some music for us, so uh, really going to be a wonderful program. Uh, Jazz for Peace, uh, in March 2007, jazz pianist, vocalist, and composer Rick Delarada was included by the Foundation Center in their list of musician philanthropists, along with Bono, U2, Elton John, Peter Gabriel, and Sting. Rick Delarada is an international jazz pianist, vocalist, and composer who has won numerous awards through his talent. Most recently, Rick was given the 2007 Jazz Appreciation Award by the American Federation of Musicians, Local 85-133, for outstanding achievement as an international jazz performer, composer, and philanthropist, giving back to the community through jazz, jazz education, charitable contributions, and Jazz for Peace performances. The Jazz for Peace mission is to continue the Benefit Concert Series to expand its performances to other cities, states, and countries to bring jazz back into the schools and expose Americans to one of the greatest yet often overlooked art forms and to donate musical instruments to underprivileged children and schools. Rick Delarada and Jazz for Peace performed at the United Nations in New York in September 2002. He led a, pan, a band consisting of Israeli, Palestinian, and American musicians in concert for an international audience in what is now considered one of the most significant cultural events of our time. This UN concert had led to a benefit concert series that has gone on to raise funds, publicity, and awareness for over 500 nonprofit organizations, garnered support and praise from distinguished Americans, and attended and enjoyed by ambassadors, celebrities, humanitarian, and music lovers worldwide. Throughout the year in 2007, Jazz for Peace will be celebrating the fifth anniversary of this historic event. Does it seem so exciting? Autumn in New York It spells a thrill of first nighting Shimmering clouds and glittering crabs in canyons of steel. Thank you. 
since you went away the days grow long and soon I'll hear old winter's song but I miss you most of all my darling